Hello guys, this is Becca, and I am here with sweet little Steven. He is sleeping away, but we're going to let him lay here. Uh, one reason I'm doing this video is I want to share a, a haul with you. I uh, purchased some things from uh, Gerber online, and I purchased their door busters, and each set of these I'm going to share with you are three onesies in the set, and they were six dollars. So, six dollars for a set. So that was what? Uh, Two dollars. Two dollars a onesie, guys. And uh, they, as far as I know, they still having the door buster going on um, on Gerber's. Uh, I think it's Gerber's Childrenwear.com. I'm not sure. I just put in Gerber's and then I looked what they brought up and I found the one for the children. And I clicked on door busters and. Uh, I got what they had going, uh, or not all of it, you know. I just mainly got onesies, and uh, I wish that I got some preemie onesies, but um, apparently they didn't have any preemie size onesies, so I didn't get preemie onesies. But yeah, I paid six dollars for a set of three. This here is size newborn, and it's a gray background. It has little white cats on it and pink flowers with gray leaves. That's one in the set. Then they have this lighter gray background, and it has little pale pink polka dots all over it. Uh... And I was looking to see if it had a bow at the neck, but it don't. It's just a plain um, gray. I start to say white. <laughs> gray with pale pink polka dots. Then the other one is a pink background with little kitty cats all over it. So that is one set of the onesies I got. And these are door busters, like I said. Um, I'm not taking these off the hangers because I want to hang them up like this. Okay, the other set, uh, or another set, I have two more sets besides this one. <laughs> uh, this is also a newborn, and I got newborn mainly, and I'm hoping my zero to threes can wear them because Gerber usually runs pretty big, um, from my experience. So hopefully the zero and three, zero to three can wear them also. Uh, but like I said, this is a newborn. It's a like a light pink background with darker pink uh, flowers and gray leaves. I love this. I really like this one. It's kind of like a fuchsia pink color background, and then it has. An outline of little rabbits and leaves all over it like it's penciled in it it's not colored in it's just the outline and I love that color love it let's see I don't think any of them has bows at the neck they don't and then this one here is like a um, I don't know if you'd call it cream off-white ivory whatever color it's not a stark white background and it has little pink and gray flowers all over it. So, let's check in. Nope, no bow at the neck. Oh, that's the right side. I was showing you the back of it. See, no bow at the neck. It's just plain, but it's pretty. What I mean by plain, there's no added anything to it, just the material that they made it out of. The, these two, I love those sets for the girls, and this is for the girls too, but I'm hoping, like I said, that it will fit a little bit bigger size Gerber runs big, 
So I got these hoping that Bethany can wear these. Look at this, guys. This is zero to three. It is a, I don't know if you'd call that hot pink, but sort of a dark pink background. And it has half pieces of avocados all over it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Then these didn't, they didn't send these on hangers. I don't know why. Then this is just a, a pretty, um, white and pink striped onesie and then this one is it's like a the ivory background um see it's a little bit uh it's not quite stark as stark white as as a white white off white i guess you might call it and it has limes all over it oh that's so pretty so I got that, hoping Bethany can wear these. Uh, then I got these that either boy or girl could wear. <laughs> and I got them in zero to three also because Landon can wear a three to six and a big zero to three. So like I said, I'm hoping that they're running a little big. But this one here is an ivory background, off-white background with bananas all over it. We need some fruit themes going. <laughs> Just some temporary fruit themes. And it don't have to be an every week thing. I may actually do it myself. Just, you know, just a temporary theme so I can use my... Um, onesies and use them you know for the theme wise and then this one is just a, a white and yellow striped one and i love this one it's a gray background with bananas and it has words on it it says let's go bananas <laughs> i need to wear the i need to put this on one of my babies and tote it around some days i feel like i'm going bananas <laughs> i love it so that is my haul that I wanted to share with you real quick. And I'm excited about those, uh, those onesies to put on my babies. And we're going to change Stephen also. Um, yeah, about the, the haul, I just, I wanted to give y'all, you know, the shout out in case you don't know about the, the sale, you know, the door buster sale that Gerber has going right now. So I wanted to tell you about that in case you would like to go check it out. I'm not no sponsored by no means. It's just something I found on sale and thought you might be interested also. They have more than onesies. They have all kind of different things in the door buster. So I thought I'd share that with you. But as you see, uh, I'm changing Stephen and I'm taking off of him a little onesie that has motorcycles all over it, which goes for my theme that I said was for Thursday, the trains, tractors, and trucks. Uh, I want to let you know that, uh, let me see, let me show you this and I can be dressing him while I'm talking. This here is a Heather Gray background it's a little romper and it has bulldozers and cement trucks and tractors and all kind of working type vehicles and it says it's got a little patch on it that says everybody digs me and then on the back on the bum is a little dump truck isn't that so cute i'm gonna put this on steven for train tractors and trucks i want to let y'all know that as far as trains tractors and trucks the theme itself is probably not original with me i'm sure i've heard that somewhere along the line um i did put it up for thursday because the only theme we had on thir have on thursday is theme thursday which is an awesome theme which uh I do my best to participate in every week 
and encourage you to do so also. Uh, but I, you know, I wasn't trying to take the place of anybody um, or take over the theme or anything like that. I just, what I was thinking about is we have on Wednesdays we wear pink. We have that on pink on Wednesdays for pink for girls. Then on Friday, we have Floral Friday, which actually I made this theme, I think, before I saw Floral Friday. I may not have. I may have done it right, right around the same time that Melissa created her theme. I can't remember. Um, but um, I just made the theme because I was thinking, you know, we have several themes on every day. But Thursday, on Thursdays, all we have is Theme Thursday, which is not a bad thing because Yvonne always puts up a theme, and I love her themes, and I participate in them every time I possibly can. I was just thinking that to put my theme on another day that I had, that's full of all different kind of themes... You know, I just was thinking, you know, I put it on the day that don't, we only have that one theme. Um, I wasn't trying to take anybody's place or, you know, butt in where I had no business. Um, I just was simply making a theme for the boys. So, and when I told you about the theme, I told you, you, you know, it wasn't something that you had to participate in. It was just something I was doing where my boys would have a theme that would give me, you know, something to look for to put on them, uh, like all the other themes that we do. And uh, that I was just doing it for myself, but that you was, re you know, you was welcome to join in if you wanted to. Uh, so my theme is not a set theme. You know, it's not something that even has to be done. I've actually thought about just stop doing it and just let it play out, you know, um, because I don't want to be out of, you know, do something out of place that I shouldn't do. So I got to thinking about it, and I do love the, the trains, tractors, and trucks, and um, I have a lot of, you know, little boy clothes that has motor vehicles on it, and I, you know, I mentioned that it didn't have to be just trains, tractors, and trucks. It could be anything that rides on the road, like bicycles, motorcycles, cars, you know, buses, vans, anything that rides on the road. Um, that, you know, it could be anything like that, a motor vehicle. Uh, I just like the sound, you know, the jingle of trains, tractors, and trucks. So that's why I titled it that instead of just automobiles, you know. Um, but it can be any type of motor vehicle that rides on the ground. And um, But I've decided that uh, instead of having it set for Thursday, this can be an any day theme. Anytime that you have a you know, your your baby is a boy that you want to share an outfit that has a motor vehicle on it, you can post it any day you want to. It doesn't have to be on Thursday. It's just something to give us something to do for our boys, like we have these other themes for girls. And I, I do like having the, the more themes for the girls because I have more girls in my nursery uh, than I do boys. So, um... And Yvonne is so good about always throwing something in that in her themes on Thursday that the boys can participate in as well as the girls. And um, that doesn't leave them out any. So my theme is not a set theme that has to be done. Uh, it doesn't have to be done every week. It's kind of like just an open theme that anytime you get something new, an outfit new that has either trains, tractors, or trucks on it, or, you know, motor vehicles on it, um, that you would like to put on one of your babies and share, you're welcome to stick that hashtag to it of trains, tractors, and trucks. Um, 
and you're you're welcome to mention me in it if you would like to you don't have to uh, I just wanted to let you know about that it's like I said I've kind of been debating back and forth whether to just you know let it play out not say anything you know not do a, the hashtag anymore on it but I decided no I like that I like that hashtag uh, I like having something for my boys but there have been days that I w had a boy baby up and I wanted to share a new outfit on a day that wasn't a Thursday so I feel like it'd be best to put it under the the column of any time you can do this hashtag any day of the week it's not set for any certain day so I just wanted to let you know about that and update you on that and share with you my sweet little Steven and his little new outfit with the little dump truck on the bum. Isn't that cute? He's got the little dump truck on the bum. Yeah. Yes, he does. So, I'm just going to let him lay here and you can look at his little dump truck. <laughs> uh, all right, guys. Uh, I'm going to go. I've already put up my Theme Thursday video for today. I wanted to do this one sharing my Gerber Gerber haul with you <laughs> and uh, tell you about the door busters that's going on at, Ger at Gerber. So uh, online, uh, they may have some in, in a store, but uh, this is online. You can go check them out if you'd like to. Like I said, it's not sponsored. I just found it. I was thrilled about the prices, and so I was just thought I'd tell you about them in case you was interested. Uh, but anyway, I'm going to go. I'm hoping to be able to get up a video on my series um, that's put out by Cena Dolls. Hashtag uh, show your doll collections. Uh, I'm hoping to get out another episode of that so i uh, will see about that hopefully i can get one out today if not i know i can't tomorrow i gotta go to the doctor tomorrow it's an hour away so that's a two hour drive round trip plus the the time of sitting in the doctor's office and all that i don't i don't know if i'll get a video up tomorrow unless i can make one today have it pre-made and scheduled for tomorrow i'd love to do that for my floral friday because i love floral friday also guys i love all the themes that you have out there some of them i don't participate in as much as others because it kind of gets stuck like i do on wednesdays we wear pink i kind of get stuck on that not that that's a bad thing but it's bad because i don't participate in the others because i just i love pink i have a lot of pink for my girls and so that's just the one I usually do on Wednesday. Um, on Monday, I try to do the Cheeky Monkey Monday when I get a video up or, or Disney Monday. I want to do Monster Monday more often. But guys, I actually don't have a lot of... I have no monster lovies. And I have very few outfits that has monsters on them. So... Uh, that's why I don't participate in that one very often. I've been trying to keep in mind to look for outfits when I'm buying stuff. To look for outfits that has monsters on it. Sometimes I think about it. Sometimes I don't. Um, then Tuesday is Toddler Tuesday. And, and this past Tuesday I participated in Tiny Tuesday. I want to do that more often because I have quite a few little preemies. Uh that could be done for tiny tuesday and um like i said theme thursday floral friday and there's fashion friday i participate in occasionally and um then on saturday is pj saturday um there's several i got listed for under saturday saturday but i can't think what they are right now sunday is dress your best sunday um snuggle sunday i don't know just what all there's several under sunday and i have quite a few under any time like jay's tag which is uh over at jay dolls uk hers is um um 
hashtag new dolly clothes that's an anytime tag that you are theme that when you buy something new and you want to share it you know you can put that hashtag on it and um and um you know share that with your with the dolly community and so we have a lot of themes to pick from and i love it I love it. I'm not able to participate in every one of them, and I'm going to try to start participating more often in the ones I don't do on a regular basis, just, you know, ever so often to give them a shout out and to show them support, and um, I love it, guys. I love all the themes, and uh, I love having a variety to pick from. Um, I'm old and I have health issues and I'm just not able to get up a lot of times more than, you know, I do good sometimes to get one video up. Um, there, There's other days that I can put up two or three, um, you know, it's according to how I'm feeling. And uh, as you see by this video, this is my second video for today. And I'm hoping to get up the third one, uh, you know, of the show your doll collections i'm hoping to get that up later this afternoon so yeah i'm just really excited i stay home all the time uh unless i have to go to the doctor and i go to church on sunday when i'm able um you know so i'm just here and so all these different themes and these things you know it's just, it's company to me. It gives me something to do, something to look forward to, something to buy for when I'm buying outfits to to look for certain things, you know, for, um, you know, things for the different things. It just gives me something to look for and to enjoy and to look forward to. So, uh, I just wanted to let y'all know that the... Um, my hashtag of trains tractors and trucks is probably not original i'm sure i've heard it somewhere i might even have been uh yvonne that i heard it from uh but i actually the day i made the tag i was trying to think of a name and i googled um good theme names and trains tractors and trucks came up as one of the theme names and um uh, I said, that's perfect. That's what I want. I want something for boys. And so I didn't intentionally or originally take it from uh, anybody else. I just simply did it because it was a theme that we could do anytime we wanted to for the boys. So uh, I'm not going to digress on it. I'm not going to take it away. Um, I, you know, I probably won't do it every week. It's just, like I said, it's according to how I'm feeling and uh, whether I can get up to them, you know, videos or whether I may just, you know, not do some of the things I've been doing on one day. If I get something uh, new that I want to share that's in that theme of trains, tractors, and trucks and, and do that one, uh, you can do it on any day. So I wanted to tell you about that. I hope you all have a great rest of your day. And I will talk with you later. Bye. Boo-da-boom-boom. -boom.